dear viewers this video gives the information about vehicle to grid and grid to vehicle with the dual active bridge operation this is that the transformer winding for dual active bridge normally that the dual active bridge it's a variable frequency here that is the bridge from the grid the another one side this is that the bridge which is derived from the vehicle battery these two system which may be connected to that coupling mutual coupling transformer that is the unit coupled unit so this is that the control which can be given into that the battery side controls and another one this is that the control value of that the uh, pwm which is controlled the dual active bridge right and uh, both the bridge circulating current which is avoided by using this this type uh, suitable delay we are going to achieve our target which is we are uh, which is uh, available here uh, please see that is uh, here grid is zero and the battery which is supply the 8 amps load total load is 8 amps again the grid is supply the 6 amps current the battery which is giving the 2 amps we are achieve the 8 amps load current again we are going to grid supply a 10 amps that is the minus 2 amps we are going to which means charge the battery and the 8 amps is low so this is that the concept which is uh, the thing we have going to this is the ev charging and discharging so this is nothing but that the grid so in the grid subsystem which is going to connected here these are all the this is the control program and this is the control unit so we are going to connected through that the grid and then the, uh, the transformer unit which is a distribution side and then it may be converted in that the bridge which is connected here right now we are going to uh, run this uh, uh, system we are going to run this uh, uh, system how the uh, system which can be uh, behave as like that the uh, general operations uh, now we are going to see the what is the operation of this uh, system okay so now i am going to run this uh, uh, unit so it may be going to start running so here that is the load is connected this is the load i am going to connect and disconnect that the load depends upon our requirement at the same time if it is the load is connected in the different point and location which is going to satisfy so this is the load voltage point again this is the current this is the current which is current supplied by that the battery and again that the this is that the current which is supplied to that the load suppose if it is the battery to grid this nodal point current which may be going to act as uh, negative please see that uh, that the operation uh, of here uh, that is in that the negative please see this that is the 8 amps which is uh, we are giving that that uh, negative again it may be going to reduce that the plus of that the 2 amps which is uh, uh, reduce again it may be going to that the plus 2 amps that is the initially the battery which is supply the battery is supply that uh, how much voltage is supplied uh, please see the uh, curve that is the battery is 8 amps is supplied again there is the grid there is no uh, uh, that is the major contributions at uh, is the zero point and another one this is the 6 we have going to be at two again that is it can be 10 amps current which can be metered by the load so the entire system which is controlled by the uh, dual active bridge that is the dual active bridge so this is that vehicle to grid system by using the uh, uh, dual active system please see that is the curve which may be come to here and then again charging conditions which can be going to in the different cases okay the available link which is uh, uh, the matlab link of this file which is available in the description